So if you're doing your chemistry degree, whether you're coming up to the end of your PhD, for example, this is the kind of advice that I'd have quite liked to have heard when I was in the same position. In particular, it's really important to get practical skills onto your CV. They need to be prominent. That's what recruiters and companies are going to be searching for. They're going to be searching for actual keywords, which are usually the practical laboratory equipment. In terms of getting that experience on your CV, if you've got time, it really is quite important. Maybe your uh, project is sponsored, try and get some time in a commercial laboratory. There are summer placements, the industrial year, um, sandwich year placement, that's particularly key. You'll be a really in-demand graduate if you do that. And as a PhD with any commercial experience, that's really desirable as well. In terms of kind of being realistic about what's on the market, um, Obviously, the chemical industry is not based in town centres generally, so I'd recommend learning to drive ahead of time. That will be really useful. Being flexible in terms of location. If you've got a specific niche of chemistry that you like, it's well worth looking at where in the country that is based. There are certain locations where there are a, a, a large concentration of types of industry and types of chemistry. So if, you're, uh, if your aspirations are towards something very specific, then look ahead of time at where realistically that's, that's gonna take you. I'd recommend having one or two recruitment consultants as well to speak to. So have a look at the types of roles that they're advertising and maybe get some word of mouth references as well. Some of these are, are real experts in their field. Look at the types of jobs they've got on their website at the moment, things like that. And those are the types of people that will give you advice on, on how to market your, yourself effectively in what is an incredibly competitive market as a candidate at the moment. I'd recommend have a look on our website. We've got more hints and tips on there.